Is your iPhone saying no SIM or invalid SIM even though your SIM card is in place? Don't panic. In this video, I will walk you through simple fixes you can try right now to get your SIM working again. Let's start with the easiest fix. Restart your iPhone. A quick reboot can fix temporary network glitches that can cause SIM errors. Restarting an iPhone is simple. Press and hold the side button and the volume up button simultaneously. Slide to power off. Wait 10 seconds and then turn the device back on. If the SIM is still not working, you should remove the SIM card and check for dust or dirt. Use a SIM ejector tool or a paper clip to remove the SIM card tray. Then take the SIM out gently. Use a clean and soft microfiber or cotton cloth to wipe it properly from both front and back sides. Blow into the tray area lightly. Do not use any water. Check the tray for bent pins or damage. If it looks bad, you might need a replacement tray. Now reinsert the SIM correctly with the metal side facing down and the angled corner aligned. Push the tray back in until it clicks. Then wait a few seconds to see if the signal comes back. If your iPhone still says no SIM, try resetting your network settings. You can easily do this by opening settings, general, tapping on transfer or reset iPhone, then tap on reset and finally tap on reset network settings. This will also reset Wi-Fi passwords, VPN and cellular settings. So make sure you reconnect to Wi-Fi afterwards. SIM is still not working. Try one of these two things. Put your SIM card in another phone to see if the problem follows the SIM. Or put a different SIM in your iPhone to see if the phone is the issue. If your SIM works elsewhere, your iPhone may have a hardware or software issue. If your SIM doesn't work in any phone, it's time to call your carrier and request a new SIM card. Outdated software can cause SIM errors. To update your iPhone, simply go to Settings, General, tap on Software Update and finally install the latest iOS update. If nothing else works, you can try a full restore using Finder or iTunes but that's the last resort. If your iPhone still says no SIM after all these steps, it could be a faulty SIM card, so contact your carrier. Or a damaged SIM card tray or reader. In that case, contact Apple support or visit a repair center. And that's how you fix no SIM card error on your iPhone. If this video helped you out, do hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more iPhone tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.